Hi, I'm Chris Bradshaw from Hexagon. During this video, now that our analysis is complete and there are no longer any remaining issues, we will see how PVLeak can help us to produce a report that can be shared with external third parties. This can be produced in Microsoft Word or PDF format, including the ability to create a 3D PDF to provide more context to the results. Okay, now the final stage, now that our analysis of this pressure vessel is complete and there are no issues, the final thing to do is to generate the report. I'm going to do this and I've already run the analysis, but I'm going to run it one more time. Uh, but before running the analysis, I'm going to hit this button here to generate a 3D PDF file. This will allow me to include a 3D page in my output report, which helps to give everything a little bit more context. So I've hit the button to turn on create 3D PDF files and I'm now going to hit analyze for one final time. Once again the analysis runs. And again no warnings appeared. And in the output again we have nothing in red just the previously mentioned warning regarding the units uh, for compliance with the ASME code. So for generating the report and for sharing with third parties, we can either export to Microsoft Word or export to a PDF file. To export to Microsoft Word, we simply select the report or reports using Shift or Control on your keyboard to select multiple reports and hit the Word document button to export the data to Microsoft Word. Microsoft Word will start in the background and the data will be exported and you'll see the Word file being built up as it goes ahead. And here's my completed Word file. So I didn't export every single report, I'd only exported a small selection. But you can see this is it's a fairly small 18 page report and here we can see all of the detailed calculations, for example, on the internal pressure calculations. We see just the same as we see inside PV Elite. In the detailed calculation results, we see here's the calculation, required thickness due to internal pressure. Here's the equation that was used. Here's where that equation comes from, Appendix 14C. Here are the numbers that were used in that equation, and here we see the answer. So you know, it's not just a black box, you see the working at every stage of the calculation. I'm going to close the Word file. Our alternative for generating the shareable report is to generate a PDF file. Now the button here will send all of the reports to the PDF file. If you wish to send certain sections and not the entire report, you can do that through the file menu within here. But I'm going to go and export all reports to the PDF file. And a full PDF will be generated, including that 3D page that I mentioned earlier. Here is the completed PDF. And again, we see if I go to, for example, from the table of contents, the internal pressure calculations, we see the same thing. As was mentioned in the Word file, we see the detailed calculations, the equation, the numbers used, the equation reference. Um, but, and what we also see is, if I go to, again, table of contents, I go to the 3D model. Uh, typically, you would have to trust the document to access the 3D and enable the 3D view. If I just trust the document and reopen it. Here is my 3D page with an interactive 3D model, which you can zoom and pan and spin around to give your report a little more context. And of course, this is now a simple PDF document that can be shared with anyone. The report itself is based upon some template files in the PVLeet install folder. So you can change these. You can adjust the logos, the headers, the footers, and the title page. Uh, of the PDF as well. And that's all there is to it. So I hope you enjoyed that video and found it useful. But remember, if you do have any questions at all, please don't hesitate to reach out to us at Hexagon. 
Thanks for watching.